waiting for you, bro. Waiting for you, champ. So that's it. Kamar Usman has said he is coming home. He didn't want to say when, so that we won't start asking questions. But hey, he says China still will be tired about it. So we'll continue to keep an eye on that one. So when he comes to town, we're going to bring him right here so that you guys can get to see the champ and interact with him. Sports tonight on your award-winning sports-loving channels television. Let's go to Abuja, the nation's capital. That's where the World Para Powerlifting World Cup is going down and it's been made a rush for Team Nigeria uh, on day two of the competition. They did so well. On the first day, the women's team got off to a flying start, winning about five gold medals. And then today, uh, the male team consolidated. A Rio 2016 gold medalist, Paul Kende, uh, wins the men's 65 kg category after a successful lift of 194 kg. Mufatu uh, Razak takes silver with 182 kg. It was 1-2 victory for Team Nigeria as Aliyu Abubakar uh, won gold and Mohamed Aliyu uh, took silver in the men's under 65 kg. That's the junior uh, category. Namdi Nassen lifts 198 kg in men's 72 a kg to also win gold. Ikechuku Obichuku finished behind champion Mohamed Elev Fat of Egypt to settle for silver in the men's 80 kg. Paulina Okpala uh, got gold in the women's 73 kg after lifting 132 kg. Thomas Kouris uh, settles for silver medal in the men's 59 kg, while three time Paralympic champion Sharif Osman of Egypt uh, got the gold. So you see what we're talking about. They are winning, but the Egyptians are also letting them feel their presence. So that's good experience for the Nigerian team, good exposure. I'll let you see uh, some of the action that went down today right there at the International uh, Conference Center in Abuja. That's para power lifting right there. You see these guys telling us a beautiful story that impossible is nothing. Uh, special athletes going out there to do special things for their country. That's him right there. Aliyu, after winning gold in the men's under 65 kg, Aliyu Abubakar uh, didn't just win gold, he also set a new record. So we love it so much. You see some of them with their condition, you start wondering, oh, what does life have for them? But with sports, they are super super stars and we love it so much so uh, the competition will uh, close tomorrow and hopefully we will be able to get some of the guys uh, that competed at this one to come talk to us get officials uh, see what is what's the lessons in organizing this one for team Nigeria that's Paul Kendi right there uh, winning gold for Nigeria and also setting a new record also uh, world champion is also Nigeria doing so well with para power lifting and I love it so much that now we've given our athletes an opportunity to compete right here at home with some of the best athletes from different parts of the world so beautiful I uh, will love it so much letting us once again feel the power of sports I love it so much Good. <laughs> 